may have to move out of your seat, but I want you to tell at least seven people, get ready, get ready. Jesus is coming. Jesus is coming. Get ready, get ready. Jesus is coming. Get ready. in you. Thank you, Lord. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Everybody standing. Woo. It won't be long. So I 
step down and shake hands with each one of you. You're going to follow Elder Johnson and Elder Smith. They're going to take you into a room and minister to you. If you don't fully understand the Lord's plan of salvation, they're going to explain it to you. If you're already saved, someone will be back there to sign you up. And as we take of the Lord's Supper, breaking of the bread and the drinking of the cup. 
Someone will serve you even back in the area where you are. You made the greatest decision you've ever made in your life when you step down these aisles today. Oh, I thank you, Jesus. Bless you, my brother. Hallelujah. Won't you follow them? Bless you, my sister. Bless you. Come on and ring it out. God bless you. She might need somebody who signs. She's not here. Oh, thank you, Lord. Glory to God. Bless you. sister that testified this morning come here for a moment our sister here come with her baby I need you to come and just 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 say what the Lord did for who is that now my nephew and what was his condition he had leukemia all and uh, he was diagnosed when he was three years old He's six years old now, and he's been healed. Now, Mother, up on your faith, because the child really does not know what's going on, but upon your faith, I command this child to be healed, delivered, set free. The ear infection Whatever the condition is, right now, the Lord healed this child. In Jesus' name, hallelujah. Hallelujah. Go in peace. God has said this child is healed. Go believe in God. Call me back. Let me know what the Lord has done. Go praise in him. It is so. It is so. Hallelujah.
keep getting older. A lot of things that my daddy used to say to me and things my mother said and things my late Uncle J.O. said, they, they become more of a reality. And I remember Bishop J.O. saying something about the old I get, the most sentimental I get. And I got to talking about the coming of the Lord about three times and got choked up and didn't know if I was going to be able to finish. All right, miss. And when I think about it, He who was wounded for my transgression, bruised for my iniquity, how he loved me so that he died on the cross, not for anything that he did, but for my sin. And we may as well be honest, since we've been saved, all of us have done some things we didn't have no business or some things we should have done and didn't do. And he keeps on loving me right on. Sacrificed his life. Oh, but I'm so glad he did. Hi! He left his mighty throne in glory to bring to me redemption story. Then he died, but he rose again. Some of y'all said for the whole world, but you ought to say just for me. Yeah. I, I, I know my time for preaching is out, but living, he loved me. Dying, he saved me. Buried, he carried my sins away. He justified, freed me forever. One day, he's coming. Oh, what a glorious day. Now, God, hallelujah, hallelujah. God, we thank you for the awesome debt paid by your son, Jesus Christ. God, we just thank you. Jesus, we just love you with all that is within us, God. God, we thank you for sending your son to die on a rugged cross to redeem us. For no sin that he had done, there was not gall that was found in his mouth. Yet he sacrificed his life, and we just thank you. Thank you, Lord. Lord, we just thank you for everything. We thank you for the power that is in the blood. We thank you for the forgiveness of sin that is in the blood. But God, we thank you for healing for our bodies that is in the blood. God, for all that we have, all that we are, we owe it to you. And we just thank you right now. Thank you from the depths of our souls. God, we just thank you right now. Hallelujah. God, you didn't have to do it. But we're so glad you did. 
and we just thank you. We thank you right now. Now, God, we ask that you will forgive every sin, blot out every transgression. As we come before the communion table, let this even be a time of healing for those who are sick in their bodies, recognizing the fact that it was your precious blood that you gave that can save the world. God, give us the strength to live up to the standards that you set. And God, we just thank you for this time. We do it in remembrance of you for the blood that was shed on Calvary. And we thank you for everything. We thank you for the power given unto us. We thank you for this time. We honor your name for your goodness and your mercy and your love. We give you the praise, we give you the honor, the glory in Jesus' name as we step before the communion table. Amen.